5. BrahMos is a supersonic cruise missile that is jointly developed by India's Defence Research and Development Organisation (DRDO) and Russia's NPO Mashinostroyenia, which have together formed BrahMos Aerospace Private Limited. Harpoon Block 2 ER Extended Range is an over-the-horizon anti-ship missile manufactured by Boeing. It is major upgrade of Harpoon Block 1 missile and is currently the main ASM anti-ship missile in USA's armor. In this video, we will compare these missiles on important parameters and draw an unbiased conclusion. Number 4 BrahMos has a stated range of 295 kilometers. Russia is a signatory to the Missile Technology Control Regime MTCR, which prohibits it from helping other countries develop missiles with ranges above 300 km. India has recently become member of Missile Technology Control Regime. It is perceived that India and Russia has the know-how to upgrade the range when required, and is currently keeping it in wraps to meet the MTCR treaty guidelines. Harpoon 2 ER has improved turbojet engine with electronic fuel controls giving it much greater range when compared to its predecessor. It uses solid propellant booster for surface and submarine launch. It has a capability to reach targets at a maximum distance of 124 km. When compared, we can see that Gramos has more than two times the range of Harpoon. Number 3 BrahMos is one-of-a-kind cruise missile, which has supersonic speed. It travels at 2.7 to 3.0 Mach. It is a two-stage missile with a solid propellant booster engine as its first stage, which brings it to supersonic speed and then gets separated. Unlike BrahMos, Harpoon is powered by traditional turbofan engine. Harpoon has speed of 864 km per hour or 0.7 Mach, which means it has high subsonic speed. When compared, we can see that BrahMos has four times the speed of Harpoon. Number 2 Additional features of BrahMos are as follows. 1. Low radar signature. 2. Varieties of flight trajectories. 3. Multiple launch platform. 4. S maneuver in final stages of flight to avoid interception. Additional features of Harpoon are as follows. 1. Uses active radar homing. 2. Low level, sea skimming cruise trajectory to avoid radar. 3. Multiple launch platforms. 4. Slightly higher warhead capacity of 221 kg compared to 200 kg of Brahmos. Number 1 Harpoon Block 2 ER has much lower range and speed when compared to BrahMos. U.S. Navy ships with the Harpoon are not only outranged by ships carrying BrahMos, but also have less time to react, if fired upon. To compensate for the Harpoon's short range and lower speed, U.S. military has typically relied upon satellites, submarines, and long-range patrol or strike aircraft to find and defeat potential surface threats long before they can target U.S. vessels. BrahMos has almost five times the mass, it is 3,000 kg compared to 650 kg of Harpoon. Also it has four times the speed of Harpoon. Hence, it has 80 times the kinetic energy of Harpoon. One hit from it will be enough to break a small ship in half or cripple an aircraft carrier. Years of disinterest in surface warfare, caused by a lack of credible adversaries, have left USA behind in this technology. There has been considerable concern in USA regarding fragile ASM capabilities. US military is currently exploring many different options to upgrade its ASM capabilities. Here are some options on which work is being carried out. 1. Long Range Anti-Ship Missile LRASM, under development by the US Navy. While the LRASM subsonic speed isn't ideal, 
it makes up for it with a range of over 920 km and stealth features. 2. Anti-ship variant of the Tomahawk, which, in a recent test, was able to hit a moving ship. The Tomahawk is a proven design and boasts a range of 1,852 km. 3. The SM-6, which has been in limited service with the US Navy as its most capable long-range anti-air and anti-missile weapons system since 2013. The SM-6 is estimated to have a range of over 370 km and flies at Mach 3.5, giving it the ability to hit an adversary at a long range with a supersonic speed. But SM-6 is primarily an air defense weapon. Relying on the SM-6 as the primary ASM, will result in US Navy ship commanders facing a worrying dilemma. Using a SM-6 against an enemy surface vessel means that, one less that can be used for the primary task of air defense. It will be interesting to see how USA goes about it. Thanks for watching. LEMO allows US and India to use each other's land, air and naval bases for repair and resupply. Watch this video to know more.